recent versions of Android have had a couple of shortcuts for applications on the lock screen. In Android 5.0 Lollipop, Google's version of this used it for the phone and the camera. In Android 6.0 Marshmallow, Google's version of Android used the camera and a shortcut for Google Now, their search service. Different OEMs choose to implement this feature differently. For example, on the Samsung Galaxy S7 with Marshmallow, they have stuck with the camera and phone shortcuts. Most OEMs besides Google will allow you to customize these shortcuts though. Now on the LG G5, you'll see there aren't any shortcuts at the bottom. However, the feature is still there. To access it, we need to launch the settings app and then tap on the display option. Tap on the lock screen option. And you're going to see right here you have a shortcuts option here to customize shortcuts on the lock screen. Now with Samsung's, you only have the option to add two shortcuts to the left and to the right. As you can see here, LG has added a whole bunch of shortcuts. And just going to add a bunch of these as examples. So we can have up to five shortcuts on the LG G5. Once you add it in, just go ahead and tap the save button at the bottom right and then you'll see that toast message telling you that the shortcuts on the lock screen have been saved so now whenever you look at the lock screen you're gonna see those shortcuts that you added so if you wanted to go into the calculator directly from your lock screen just tap it and drag it up And as you can see, it instantly launched the calculator app directly from the home screen. This will work for any of the other applications that you have set for shortcuts. And if you don't want to use those, you don't even have to. We can remove some of these just so we can show you what it'll look like. So if you have two on the left and one on the right, we save it. And then on the lock screen, it just has three. It doesn't keep the position. It just keeps the, the shortcuts that you've added.